What is going on, y'all? What is up? Mr. Man, the dog, Peso, 420, Chief E, all that rolling in the wine. I'm just sitting down here, and this is my first commentary. I know my voice sounds smooth as shit, sound like a fucking DJ radio host or some shit. But I'm gonna just sit here for a second and um, smoke this beezy and vibe out and fucking just let some shit flow off my brain, you know? Fucking let this be a session of just the mind, you know? And I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna call this commentary or whatever it's gonna be. I'm gonna find some game to, some gameplay to put with this or something. But there's no reason for this commentary. There's no point behind it. There's just talking. And you know, when a motherfucker get to talking and just sit back and smoke, you start to think about some shit. You know? I mean, this isn't for a non smoker. I mean, if you drink and smoke, this could be for you. If you smoke, this could be for you. But if you're sober, I don't know how much help that it could be for you. But we'll see when this get done, if it helped you out or not. And if it did help you, go subscribe to that channel, man. Give it a like. Smash that su subscribe button. Smash that like button, too. But hit me down in that comment section. Tell me what's good. Tell me what's going on in your mind. Because right now, it's about... Fucking 945. I was supposed to do this commentary a little bit earlier. But I had some things going that I had to handle prehand before doing this. So I tried to get done with that as quick as I could so I can come back and do this for y'all. And not only for y'all, for me too. Because I love doing this YouTube thing, man. It gives me an outlet to be creative. And I mean any motherfucker with a creative side got something to do. I mean, pain, um, music, um, poetry, anything. And I don't know what that might be. That could be anything. But when people do what they do, it gives them an outlet and their own kind of therapy. You know what I mean? I mean, some people, they get on Call of Duty and they rage for fun. They let all their anger out on Call of Duty and scream. And most people, they get on there and scream obscenity, racial slurs and stuff. But most people, they get on there just to have a real good overall rage time and just have fun. But whatever makes you happy in life, man, do you. Don't let nobody ever tell you that you cannot fucking do what the fuck you want to do. It's your life. Live it the fuck you way you want to live it. If you let them dictate what the fuck you do with your life, you'd never be able to live it to the fullest, you know? And you'll always be wondering what the fuck another motherfucker is thinking. You know what I'm saying? But... Take this to mind when you're thinking of what they're thinking. Fucking, when you die, they didn't make motherfucking caskets and bum bags. You know what I'm saying? So, when you die, take that shit to your grave by yourself. You ain't got to worry about know what everybody else said about you or nothing. Fucking, you got to worry about how you had you lived your life. Did you live it righteous? Did you live it wrong? Did you wicked? Or did you just try to give up, get over on everybody and do a whole bunch of back shady shit? And fucking my philosophy, philosophy, my bad, I got tongue tied for that. But my philosophy is live righteous, don't be wicked, do unto others if you want to do to you, and just live life, man. Be fun. I mean, I try to be fucking what's the word for it kind no not kind courteous that's the word courteous to everyone in a simple fashion 
but I'm not going to take it to an overextent and be over friendly because that's not how I was grown up as a child. I was never a real friendly child. I was to really just sit around. But this commentary, man, is basically just a rambling of the mind, like I said. And if you enjoyed it, man, smash that like, smash that subscribe button because there's going to be more of them. And, bruh. Stay lifted. If a motherfucker say don't smoke, smoke, smoke. I don't give a fuck. Do you, man. Whatever makes you fucking happy in your fucking life, man. Do you. And that's been my message for the day, man. I mean, it wasn't much, but it's a message, man. You can take it or you can leave it. And that's what it is. It's been a dude, man. Chief of 420. Chief of E. Peso. All that. And now, um, I don't have no fucking sign off for nothing. But, um, should I fuck with y'all next time, man? Get at the dude, bro. Ladies, too. I can't forget about y'all, ladies. And if my voice made y'all moist, get that motherfucker a thumbs up. You know what I mean?